My name is Aaron Chandler and you're watching Coast Chai YouTube channel. The perfect place for theme park news, reviews and vlogs. After all, I've always got roller coasters running through my mind. <laughs> Hello there everybody, my name is Coach Chad Donksterborn, but built for Theme Park News, and welcome to another Theme Park Newsroom update. The Theme Park News update is coming thick and fast this year uh, for the start of the 2020 season. Now this is from SeaWorld San Antonio and this is on 2021. Yes, that's the thing with the theme park industry. As soon as you enter a brand new year, you had to count down to the teasing campaign for the next new attraction in the next year. So that's the good thing about the, these theme park stuff. You always have to count on 2021 teasing now. So before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Share this channel around with your friends, family, and on social media. We're getting closer and closer to 1,500 subscribers. So we're getting closer and closer to that mark. Make sure you do. And now let's get into this teaser video. So SeaWorld San Antonio have revealed at the Ace Winter of Fest um, this January uh, a teaser for 2021. Now this may give something away, but it may also give nothing away. It's a bit of a wishy-washy kind of thing. Now the official image from Ace South Central on Twitter, big credit goes to them on your screen now. Find a bedorsey. Says something big is coming to SeaWorld San Antonio 2021 in the corner. And of course the giant puffer fish with a very shocked face. That could be a meme. That could be that image. Uh, <laughs> uh, I was looking through forums actually and what people were saying about what it could be. I saw a spinning coaster. I saw uh, another type of I saw different types of rides. Um, maybe like a, a dome type ride like the one in Turtle Track. Um... Like, like, like in the Turtle Trek area, um, you know, it's it, it, it's an interesting one. Obviously, uh, the puffer fish could just be a symbol of excitement, or it might have something to do with the ride. Now, if it's something to do with the ride, of course, puffer fishes, you know, blow out as you you know a lot of people uh, know already. If they've got their knowledge on fish and the aquatics, uh, puffer fish sort of blow out, um, you know. And they look like a, a ball, don't they? Like, like like a giant spiky ball. Um, so if they so if they blow out, are they going to shape shift into a, a frisbee? Or no, no, no. <laughs> They've already got a frisbee ride. Uh, <laughs> but I tell you what, you know, I think that a pufferfish coaster might be good. I'm not going to lie, it would be good. Um, like sit inside the giant spiky pufferfish ball uh, and get spun around the track as you sort of. Um, you know, deflate and whiz around the ocean. So you've got ocean blue track, uh, and you're sort of whizzing about inside a giant spiky pufferfish ball type coaster train. Um, if it was a spinning coaster, I'd like to see Marison do it as the classics, but I'd also, also like to see Mac do it. Uh, it wouldn't be an extreme spinning coaster because even though they're teasing it this early, I think construction uh, would need to take a while. Uh, I think an extreme spinning coaster would be good. But I would more recommend the Mac Family Spinning Coaster, especially since they're going to be doing uh, the largest Woody in Texas uh, this year, Texas Stingray uh, from GCI. So I think, you know, sort of a, a family through all GCI followed by uh, a big Mac Exchange Spinning Coaster the following year. I think it's not impossible, but it's highly unlikely. So I think if we were looking for a spinning coaster, we'd be looking either for Marison or a Mac family version like Sierra Sidewinder at Knott's Berry Farm or Storm Chase that's going in this year at Polton's Park in Turner Springs um, you know there's a lot of Mac family spinning coasters Turbulence um, there's also Toverland's um, Mac family spinning coaster Dwerbal Wind uh, that opened back in 2012 there's the Twist that opened in 2011 at La Paul in France so there's a lot of models of Mac family spinning roller coasters um, so I think a spinning coaster is a viable option. Uh, the family spinning coaster being the most likely out of the two, but I think an extra spinning coaster isn't completely ruled out. Uh, so it should be interesting to see. I mean, it did say something big was coming, so I don't know if they're just anti-climaxing the thing. Um, but, you know, it's possible. It's definitely possible. Uh, so I want you to get your predictions in the comments down below. I want you to get your first predictions in. What do you think is going to happen? What do you think this is going to be? Um, 
and I want you to share your thoughts in the comments down below. Uh, so thank you very much for watching this theme park news update from SeaWorld San Antonio in Texas. Uh, like I said, very excited for this edition, can't wait for it to happen. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. And for now guys, my name is Coach Shell, keep on the coast of life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, I'm Nelson Demi.